we're making an episode today about about telling a joke in public, and uh, who who who's better to ask than our stand-up comedian friend? Who's gonna tell a joke in public? Yeah. Tricky idea, man. Yeah. I, I've actually done comedy in public. Uh huh. And uh, people kind of just don't give a f. They just kind of oh. keep walking. Alright, so the rules were simple. We found four terrible jokes on the internet. Here they are, you can pause if you want to read them. And chose four different locations around the city. And we're going to leave it up to chance to determine who says what and where. I'll go first. You can't look. You can't look. Oh, um, I really hope, is, what's this? The places or uh, places? Yeah. <laughs> oh my God. I get, I get to take my joke then. No. No, f you. No, 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 no. I, I will pick my joke. I will no say, I will say them. No, there is bending room. This is a f university class. I'm dude, not. This is how you do it. No. Okay, dude, we dude. agreed on this before we started. Dude, we this is where the rules. I got the burrito. <laughs> Oh my god, I'm so happy with <laughs> <laughs> I got the dad joke, baby! Nice! Yes! Alright, here's the draw. Amar got the burrito joke in a university class. Matt got the dad joke in a library. Darren, our cameraman, got the bar joke in a bus. And me, Thomas, I got the muffin joke at a grocery store. Dude, apparently the prof is intense. He doesn't like people making announcements. That's what Sophie was telling me. Oh my god. I'm sorry, I can't find my, my younger brother was here a second ago. Is there any way I could use the intercom to call him out? Hey guys! Just a quick announcement. Hey guys, uh, do you want to study breaker? I mean, I feel like I have a joke. Sorry, I would just like to tell a very short English joke. Uh, Matt, I'm waiting for you in the, at the cash. I also have a joke. You know when you get a burrito back and it's not folded properly and it's missing the meat, it's missing the guac, it's missing the beans, and it's made out of paper. It's your midterms and you failed. So here it goes. So I couldn't believe my dad was stealing from his job as a road worker until I came home and all the signs were there. <laughs> a polar bear walks into a bar and the bartender says, what will you have? And the polar bear goes, I'll have a, a beer. And then the bartender goes, why the long pause? And he goes, I don't know, I've always had them. No, no, no. There's two muffins, and they're in the oven. And one muffin says to the other muffin, Damn, it's getting really hot in here. And the other one says, Oh my god, a talking muffin. <laughs> Thank you. I told a joke, right? right? I'm sad that no one laughed. <laughs> Thanks for listening. Thank you. Dude, that was so fucking good. <laughs> God damn. A horse walks into a bar. A dyslexic walks into a bra. Alright, last ones. Last ones. A man walks into a bar. Last one. Last one. A blind man walks into a bar. One more. One more. I hope to be out of the bus by now, so. <laughs> You can't join us without participating. So what Thomas doesn't know is that he's wow. next. <laughs> he's next. What? And we have a terrible knock knock no. joke for him. No. <laughs> I was nice enough to help you. You guys want a study break? I have a joke. Five seconds. Knock knock. Who's there? Who's there? Nana. Nana who? 
Nani of business. Oh, wow. All right. <laughs> Say it again. Say it again. I, I think I killed it. <laughs> that's standing the best like joke this. of them all. Standing like this is the best. <laughs> I mean, I have no shot. I have no shot. The shitty ass joke that Thomas wrote.